Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome. So in today's video, I'm going to share with you guys 50 jobs that you could get in Jamaica. And I'm going to try and share the minimum salary for some of these jobs if I can get the information on them. So, if you guys are interested, guys, I'm sharing 50 jobs that you can potentially have down here. Stay tuned and let's begin. Okay, the first one is accountant. Now, account you can be accounted for like various different types of companies and being accounted for various different types of things and the salary starting at two million it can be all the way up to four million and that may include like medical and life insurance as well depending on the company that you're going to be working at working for as an accountant the next one is a data entry officer or a data analysis you can become a veterinarian if you love animals or a mobile veterinarian so you can work for a company or you can be stationed at a company or you can be mobile so you're going to different homes which is really cool. I had multiple mobile veterinarians come to the house here. You can become an educator, a teacher. For some reason, down here, I know I noticed on a lot of the job posting websites, there was hiring for teachers, whether it's well, basic school, primary school, high school, college, as a university as a lecturer. So they're always looking for teachers and educators. There's so many out there that they're looking for. I trust me, I've seen countless amount of job posting so they're hiring down here and they're hiring for both public and private schools hotel manager so you can be working in like operations or anything along those lines be a social worker so you can be a medical social worker you can be a family social worker so on and so forth <laughs> and a social worker can start at 1.4 million in interviews you can always 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 negotiate for higher and again these are just starting pay so it's not necessarily what you would get you probably may get more depending so if you have a degree in environment you can work for environmental based companies so you can work for the government established forestry department where you can do management supervision so basically you like manage forest resources on a sustainability level of course to assist with environmental services and economic benefits that they provide. They could hire for like a forest manager, for a supervisor, forester that looks over like budgets and working with the stakeholders of the company. And the forester can start at 2.4 million. So you can be a clerk for various businesses. I noticed a lot of online websites that post job posting, they're always, a lot of these businesses are looking for clerks. So basically a clerk helps with maintaining a business. To, keep it running effectively and smooth so they would be answering phones sorting through mail organizing business files maintaining files um, answering phones running errands and a lot of other tasks as well you can become a physician now i have a video on my channel on how tips on how to land your dream job in interviews and i go through it and i share all the tips for you guys to land your dream job whether it's in an office or a very established business my tips will help you land that job so i'm going to link that video so you guys can watch it watch it thoroughly take notes and learn so you can get one of these jobs that are in this video here oh and also shout out i love the website jamaican medium so i'm going to link them down below they post job opportunities but I, they remind me of the jamaican version of indeed so you guys can definitely check them out and, and always keep updated on new job postings okay you can be a marketer a chef a receptionist can be a doctor that works up in maternity a neurosurgeon which i heard actually gets paid the most in jamaica and it's starting at four million virologist or just a general practitioner you can be a sales associate a farmer now one thing that we have to talk about is that you can apply for a lot of these jobs in jamaica but it's so weird once you read the requirements a lot of these jobs require you having degrees for entry-level positions like if you go to Canada, America, all you need is like your high school diploma. And like down here, they want you to have like a bachelor's and this, that, and that, and the fourth. And then on top of it, they want you to have five years experience. So a lot of these companies down here, they, they want you to obtain so much schooling and experience for you to get a small pay. And it's really weird to me. I don't know how anyone can get a job down here because of that. I remember like when I was in when I just finished high school and I was looking for a job at Digicel. I was like, for this position, you guys want a bachelor's degree, what? And you're getting paid what? And what? And how much experience do you want just for an entry level position? Okay, let's move on. So a construction worker, mechanic, spot therapist, or attendant. Guys, if you know any more jobs that you could get down here, comment them down below. Or give this video a thumbs up if you're liking these suggestions so far you can become an architecture stop it architect get some help <laughs> that's an architecture you can be an architect <laughs> architect wait a 
minute. And that can start at two million. You can be a technician, and based on the company, what type of technician? It can be an audiovisual technician. It can be a maintenance technician. It can be accounting technician. There's so many. You can be a manager, coordinator, supervisor for a production company or a project development company. You can be a dentist, chiropractor. You can be a computer information software manager. And that's starting at five million. Again, you guys, this is base. I may be even saying less than what people actually make, to be honest. So just keep that into consideration. You can be a lawyer, and I think their base pay is starting at five million. And the the more experience you have, the higher your pay is. You can be a nurse, a registered nurse, all these type of nurses. You can be that down here. Are you guys subscribed yet? Make sure you guys subscribe and hit the subscribe button because I have a lot more videos. I have a lot more Jamaican based videos similar to this on my channel. You can be an actuarial analyst or actuarian or actual. I don't know how to pronounce that word, but basically they look at risk for companies. And they look at changes and what the risks are and all that stuff. So that's starting at 2 million, but that's something you guys can consider. I don't know how to pronounce it, but I'm gonna put the correct wording on the screen. And that one's starting at 5 million, so they say. But I feel like that job is like very high stress because if you mess up someone's prediction on risk for their company and they're gonna be like we pay you all this money for you to mess up fired <laughs> that's embarrassing and people won't you can be an air traffic controller and this one is to prevent aircrafts colliding with each other and also to help with safe landings at airports right and that one's starting at five million as well so you can be a customer service associate for multiple companies but there is a lot of call centers in Jamaica and I feel like that's a really good entry level position that you can start off in and then grow within the company, which is really good. They have so many different departments that people can work and grow in. So there's HR, there's being a team leader, you can be a recruiter, a healthcare associate. So there's endless opportunities and I feel like working at call centers in Jamaica is the easiest place that you can apply to, most easiest to find and to apply to, which all jobs down here should be like that. but. Yeah, so that one I would recommend like anyone who wants to start off in an entry level level position to gain experience, work at a call center, okay? Get that like, one year experience on your resume and then if you don't like it, move on to a different position or change your position in the company for something that you like. You can become an engineer and you would have to pick what type of engineer you'd want. You can be like a software en engineer, a petroleum engineer. And I think like engineers start at 2 million. If you're a petroleum engineer, that's starting at 5 million. You can be a pharmacist, you can be a pilot. That's fine. You can be an educator teaching people one-on-one -on -one classes on anything that you're good at. Waxing, eyebrows, massages, language, photography, makeup extensions, eyelash extensions, makeup, like the list is endless. You can be a tutor, after-school tutor for students, driving instructor tutor, teach someone a different language. You can become a firefighter. You can become a soldier. Now with the soldier, the more expertise or experience that you have, the higher your pay would be. So if you went to school for engineering and you're like, you know what, I want to become a soldier here in Jamaica, you'd probably get a higher pay because you have the engineer experience or you have that electrical degree you can get like a little bit more work i'm pretty sure that's how it works follow me on instagram at anisha.adams to stay updated whenever i don't post on youtube i'm over there on instagram posting so make sure you guys follow me there you can be some type of police you can be a frontline police officer you can become a correctional officer you can work in the special investigations unit you can be a probation officer or courthouse officer you become a photographer people are always getting married there's a lot of content creators influencers work with them a lot of parties are always happening in jamaica become a photographer because you can be a manager a brand manager for villas and hotels you can be a brand manager for um, celebrities artists musicians influencers content creators is a big wave right now just know that if you have connections and you're good at managing people and building them like building their brand and how to position themselves as official and professional that you can manage and profit from because you're just good at managing them helping them get opportunities build themselves as a brand you'll be in Become a freelancer or entrepreneur and bring something new to Jamaica that isn't already here, that Jamaica is in need of, that there is a demand on, and bring, and bring a modern style and twist to it and you're able to grow. You can become a realtor, so promote and sell properties to people obviously wanting to buy, or you can be, or you can go into real estate, so you can build your own buildings and plazas and rent it out to people, which I love the second part. I love the real estate part. So you can definitely think about doing that or like homes to rent out, apartments to rent out to people. Buy homes, flip them, and then sell them back. Now, I feel like that's a really profitable one in Jamaica because a lot of people are always looking for places to rent. You can work at a daycare down here. 
I love that one. I'll, there's a few daycares down here that I've seen. Just in Spalling's alone in Manchester, I've seen an endless amount of daycare, so I can only imagine Kingston. So you can work at a daycare in many different positions. I'd, one thing about Jamaica is, though, that I don't like let, a lot of entry positions for jobs you can't find online. It's mostly they advertise in person or at the front of their store. They write on a piece of paper and say, hey, we're hiring for blah, blah, blah. I don't like that. I feel like a lot of things in Jamaica need to be more digital and promoted well and advertised more professionally. So yeah, I once I found, I was calling a supermarket for someone because they saw a job listing and they were saying that the person had to be 25 and they needed to have, um, I think it was like three years experience working at a supermarket and the pay was so little when they told me. I was like, what? This position is for like a high school. A boy that was interested was 17. So he was like, oh, I would work at a supermarket just to have experience on my resume. I mean, when we found out, we both looked at each other and we were like, what is that? Like, why do you have to be 25 and have three years experience just to work at a supermarket? And the pay is like regular minimum wage pay. You can basically be a task rabbit, so you, people can hire you to do simple tasks for them, which is super cool. You can come and set up their furniture for them. You can come and fix this for them. You can come and do that for them. So this could actually be really good for teens. You can become an Airbnb tour guide. If you go on Airbnb, you can definitely see that people offer experiences through Airbnb and they get paid through it, so why not? So I've seen people doing like, oh, come do a tour of the mountains and then go swimming right after, and then they pay a certain amount of money, and people love that. People love authentic Jamaica, real Jamaica, so that's something you guys can consider. You can become a security guard for both public institutions and both private, for private people, for private institutions as well, okay? That one's a good one. You can become a truck driver. You get paid good a good amount of money, so. You can be a judge. You can be an immigration officer and or you can work for the prime minister. So there's all these different things under that. You can be a director, you can work in administration, you can be a facilities manager. Oh, you can also be a marketer. And last one, I want you guys to comment down below the last job that you can get down here that I have not mentioned. There's endless amount of jobs and I did not even mention them here. Comment below the 50th job. I have another video on my channel where I talk about online jobs that you can get in Jamaica. So you guys can definitely watch that and I'm going to link on this video similar videos to job interviews and jobs in general. So if you guys are interested, you guys watch that and I'll see you guys in my next video. Au revoir!